When you're a prince, you're used to having your every word scrutinized. Prince William felt this significantly after a recent interview. Keep watching to discover which of Prince William's comments about Ukraine has Twitter in flames. The Russian invasion of Ukraine has forced the world to take sides. The royal family, including Queen Elizabeth II, has declared their stance with Ukraine. Prince William and Kate Middleton recently showed their support for the people of Ukraine by packing up donations at the Ukrainian Cultural Center in London. It turns out that sometimes actions don't speak as loud as words, though, especially when it comes to royals. Not everyone is happy with the words Prince William used after he was finished packing donations. William said in a statement to The Independent, It's very alien to see this in Europe. We are all behind you. We feel so useless. Despite William speaking in support of Ukraine, some people see the message as being a bit cold. The sentiment that Prince William makes about his sense of helplessness is relatable to people around the world, but it's another word in the statement that is rubbing people the wrong way. Twitter users have become fixated on William's use of the word alien. Users feel that the prince is saying that while other places in the Commonwealth are used to this kind of war, Europe is not. One Twitter user is quoted as saying, In case you missed it, Prince William said it's it's rather normal to see war and bloodshed in Africa and Asia, but not Europe. Other people are getting a bit more brutal with their comments, one user said. So, those comments made about Archie's skin color. It was William, wasn't it? The user is referencing Meghan Markle's Oprah interview, where she and Prince Harry talked about how unnamed members of the royal family allegedly wondered what skin color their first child would be. Emotions are extremely high right now, so it makes sense that people are reading into the statement and want more from their leaders. Hopefully, Prince William understands why his comments were so offensive. Social media may have reacted harshly to Prince William's latest comments on Ukraine, but they had a significantly worse response to his brother Prince Harry and wife Meghan Markle saying anything at all. The Sussexes condemned Russia's invasion of Ukraine on their official Archwell website, decrying it as a breach of international and humanitarian law. We stand with the people of Ukraine and encourage the global community and its leaders to do the same. Although it seems like a fairly reasonable sentiment on the surface, Twitter immediately tore the couple apart for deigning to wade into such serious matters. Meghan's biggest fan, Piers Morgan, sarcastically quipped, This will really rattle Putin, in a tweet sharing the statement, while his Daily Mail cohort, Richard Eden, posted a similar joke writing, It's all over for Putin. The Mail in general dedicated plenty of column inches to criticizing the Sussexes' stance, including in an article entitled Putin is Shaking in His Boots. Twitter users remark on Harry and Meghan's defiant statement that they stand with the people of Ukraine. Elsewhere, The Sun chided them with the headline, Oh, well done. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle mocked on Twitter after wading into Ukraine crisis. Although Twitter users have been going back and forth over whether the royals should be weighing in on the Ukraine crisis at all, President Volodymyr Zelensky was at least great for their support. He publicly thanked Prince William and Kate Middleton after they threw their support behind the country. Zelensky tweeted that he and his wife, Elena Zelensky, are grateful to the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge that at this crucial time when Ukraine is courageously opposing Russia's invasion, they stand by our country and support our brave citizens. Notably, President Zelensky excluded Prince Harry and Meghan Markle from his royal shout-out, which is sure to have delighted their online critics. Harry, meanwhile, made a public plea for the people of Ukraine. He emphasized that they needed the world's continued support all while accepting an award at the NAACP Image Awards. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more list videos about the royal family are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.